would you give them as far as being able to um, just being being the like entrepreneur lifestyle? What advice would you give them? Starting with you. Forward, to keep moving forward and they dreaming. To be to be an entrepreneur and to be successful, I believe you have to stay consistent. Yeah, I believe that's you have to. To know yourself first. When you know yourself, you can help others. And realize that self-love is the key to self-success. Because everything is already put in place in the universe on what you're gonna have. But however, you can exceed what you already have in the universe. There's no limit to what you can do. So therefore, get to know the better you. Because as I always say, after 40 is an amazing life, but before 40, if you can only get to know yourself, then it would be an amazing life. I know they real self and so they get about that. Eh? So they're going back to you. What is a piece of advice that you would give an entrepreneur or, you know, anyone in your shoes that's looking forward to being able to start their own business so they don't have to work a nine to five, start their own business so they can be able to have a legacy for their kids. So they can have brown children on the Forbes list. Their grandchildren can be on the Forbes list. They can be on the Forbes list. What advice would you give them? Determine. It's all about being determined. If you want something, you're going to get it. And if you fall, you just get right back up and go forward again. And that was key. Because I, I guarantee you, you're going to fall. And that's the I thing. guarantee I, you. And you only fall because you, you just, it, it happens, you know? And you have, but you have billions. For me, I'm on to the next project all the time. Three, four times I'm, I'm really on to the next right. project every time. This song is failed. I can go way right back and pick right up. Yeah. I was outside. How long? Yeah, they the, did. The light didn't become yeah. a, a success till he died. Hold on. Yeah. Floyd got so much money, but Floyd don't do the right things with it, all those billions it will can go down. down. And, and, yeah. Yeah. So what is a piece of advice that you would give an entrepreneur, somebody that's in your shoes, or who wants to be an entrepreneur? They're very I would think that, that um, Stan, probably tell, actually Stan, you're motivated, and have people around you motivate you, um, have a family member to motivate you. It's um, okay. Actually, just like just actually sticking together and making sure that um, people could be able to, you know, see we on the rise and what your brand is and what you're trying to do. Absolutely. And she has a very smart um, And actually, I would think, you know, to and then Ryan to be able to um, um, pass it down to your family members and your, you know, your loved ones, your children, your family. Absolutely. I'm trying, but I, I like that. Wise. You know, not just for just yourself, but just the whole family to incorporate. So, Tiffany, what is one goal that you would say, or not just a goal, but what is one piece of advice that you would give an entrepreneur that's in your shoes or who wants to be an entrepreneur? Like, what is one piece of advice that you would give an entrepreneur that's in your shoes or who's, you know, want to be, that's an inspiring entrepreneur? What would you say? Um, don't wander aimlessly. Like, know mm. exactly what you're trying to work towards, know what you're trying to achieve. Be led. I'm Christian, so I'll say be led by God, but also, like, be led by whatever is motivating you so that you know exactly what you're working for. If you don't have an end goal, if you don't know what you're doing it for, then you're just going to be too blank. Like, you're going you're to be trying to achieve stuff that you don't even know exactly what you're trying to achieve. If you have ex an exact destination that you're trying to get to, you work harder and you work smarter because you know exactly what you're trying to achieve. So that's about it. Right. And I can that's agree. Right. Yeah. You know, I would definitely say, as far as like one yeah. piece of advice that I would give an entrepreneur is to um, have a plan, have a goal. You know, mark your goals. Whether it's just you know for that month, for the next month, you know, being able to go along with knowing that you know you are successful. Put it in the atmosphere. Speak existence, uh, positive tip, positivity over your life. Speak things into existence because what the energy that you put out there is the energy that you will be receiving. So